broccoli, even fish. It'll keep your breath sweeter, cleaner, and fresher smelling. Um, excuse me, uh, Breland or whoever your name is, whatever your name is, you're definitely not acting like me. Um, are you doing some kind of commercial or something like that? <sighs> As a matter of fact, I am, and I'm not finished. So the Aura brush actually lasts longer than your toothbrush and only has to be replaced every three to four months. Okay, <laughs> wait, wait, ugh, wait. I'm pretty much done with you, so I think I'm just going to explain in my own way with this crazy Breland-like person is talking about because this just isn't going to work, okay? Bye! Yeah. Wait, we can work this out! No! Okay, now that she's gone, really sorry about that and everything, but uh, sometimes that part of me gets a little bit carried away, but anyway, pretty much what this video is going to be about is my oral hygiene, my oral routine, as well as a product called the Aura Brush Tongue Scrubber that really plays a huge role in my oral hygiene. And before we get into all of that, let's get a little bit more comfortable, shall we? Okay. There. Much better. How do you like my shabby new background right there? Okay, so back to my oral hygiene. So as far as my oral routine, I brush my teeth twice a day, I floss twice a day, and I use mouthwash twice a day to help keep my mouth clean and fresh and smelling good and to help fight that bad breath. But another thing that I've been using that I've really been loving is the Aura Brush. And this is the Aura Brush Tongue Scrubber. And you actually scrub your tongue with this little thing. And as you know, well, I don't know if you know this or not, but 90% of bad breath is caused from your tongue. And that's mostly because of food that gets stuck to your tongue and bacteria and all kinds of internal mucusy, nasty things that get stuck to your tongue. Let's not get into all that. You know what I mean. And this little thing here completely erases that and it cleans your tongue and it keeps that nasty bad breath away. And I've also been using this with the Aura Brush Tongue Foam. And this is a really minty, yummy tongue foam. And what you do is you use this with the Aura Brush and you scrub your tongue with it. So let me give you a little example as to how I use the Aura Brush. Okay, so before using the Aura Brush, I'm just going to go through my normal morning routine and that would be to brush my teeth. So here I have my toothbrush and my toothpaste and I'm ready to go. And as you can see, my toothbrush really doesn't have a good tongue scrubber on the back of it. And that's where the Aura Brush is going to come in. So now I'm just going to put my toothpaste on my toothbrush, unsuccessfully that is. <laughs> and then I'm just going to begin to brush my teeth. Okay, so before we start using the Aura Brush, I just wanted to tell you a little story. Well, more like a happily ever after story about the Aura Brush. And I'm pretty sure all of you out there who love those kind of stories are going to love this. So, once upon a time, there was a man by the name of Dr. Bob Wagstaff, a 75-year-old inventor who had so much faith in his product that he spent eight years and $40,000 trying to bring Aura Brush to the market. He approached all the big retailers, such as big stores that you and I both love to shop at, such as Walmart, Walgreens, and CVS, but they all turned him down. Then one day, Dr. Bob met a college student who also had faith in his product and in turn brought YouTube into the equation of marketing the Aura Brush. So they put their heads together and made a YouTube video for around $200, uploaded it, and the video started to climb in views. In fact, it went viral, getting millions of views and so did the offers that started to pour in from the many companies from all around the globe wanting to manufacture Dr. Bob's product. Oh, and guess who else was calling for Aura Brush? Yeah, several of the big retailers who turned them down in the beginning. But of course, Dr. Bob accepted their offer, and Aura Brush is now being sold on Walmart, CVS, and Walgreens shelves all around the world. So, that just goes to show that all you really need is to believe in something, have a lot of faith, drive, and determination to achieve your goals. And, let's not forget Dr. Bob achieved all of his goals only using YouTube. So, from Dr. Bob's basement workshop to retailers all around the world, the Aura Brush was the first product to ever go from nothing to national retail distribution just using YouTube. The end. Okay, so 
So now that we learned how the Aura Brush came to be, let me show you how to use it. So here's the Aura Brush, and the bristles used to clean your tongue were designed after a surgical scrub brush surgeons used to wash their hands with before surgery. I know, kind of scary, but hey, it works amazing. And here's the Aura Brush tongue scrubbing foam, and I really love their tongue mascot on the back. He's really cute. And look, as seen on YouTube. So next, I'm just going to take the cap off of it, and this is what it looks like when I squeeze it out, and it's just a really foamy, minty texture. And then you do not want to do what I just did because I just wanted to see what it tasted like out of sheer curiosity and it's extremely strong. So next I'm just going to take a poof of this minty fresh foam and put it onto the Aura brush and this is what it looks like and you can put as much of it as you want as you like. So then you just want to take the Aura brush and place it on the back of your tongue and then pull it forward. And beware because you might see some really nasty stuff on it after you're finished as you can see here but luckily my tongue was already really clean so now my tongue is super clean and I'm finished with the Aura brush. So next I'm just going to move on to flossing which is the fun part, not really. But anyway, I'm just going to take some floss and floss my top and bottom teeth. And yes, I know I look really silly when I do that. So that's all for my oral routine. Okay, so that's all for this video. I really hope y'all enjoyed learning about my oral routine and my oral hygiene. And I hope y'all enjoyed watching my little aura brush tutorial, which I had a lot of fun doing. And don't you go nowhere because I have something I want to tell you. So, if you there, sitting right there in front of your computer, if you would like to try the Aura Brush for free, all you have to do is go to AuraBrush.com slash free, and I'll leave the link in the description below so you can go to it and sign up now. All you have to do is pay for shipping, and they will send you your first Aura Brush for free. And you can try it. Let me know how you like it. I'm pretty sure that it won't let you down. I'm sure that you're going to love it. So, I thank you so much for watching and have a glitterful day.